Bill Cunningham Show. Why did you go to prison for four years? For beating my child. Betrayed by their bad mom. I would have thought that you was going to change and you still say. You broke her arm. You beat her. And she loves you. And and she wants a relationship. My daughter is lazy and she does not take care of her kids. A mother-daughter tug of war. She has made me feel like I am so useless of a parent. Right now. Thanks for coming and thanks for watching. How would you define a bad mom? My guests today say that would mean betrayal and abuse are the words that come to their mind. Please welcome Michelle to the show. Michelle, how you doing? Hi, I'm fine. I'm All right. Uh, let's talk about the abuse that you suffered as a child. The abuse that I suffered as, as a child and things that I can't remember is watching my sisters and my sisters getting abused and remember her arm was being broken. The arm was broken of one of your sisters? Yes, sir. By your mother? By my mother. No question. Mm-hmm. What else did she do to, to you and your brothers and sisters? She, like, verbal, and my sister was always tied to a chair. Tied up? Mm-hmm. Your younger sister tied physically for how long? Until she got back. How long? How long? A couple of hours. A few hours? She, well, well, ropes? A, a phone card? A phone cord. Mm-hmm. And this went on on a regular basis. Yeah. Have you learned of other situations where uh, the children were put into uh, scalding hot water? Yeah, my, my sister Chantel. Yes. And is it fair to say your younger sister Chantel mm-hmm. is the one that got it the worst? Yes, sir. And uh, Chantel's arm was broken. She was tied to chairs. In hot water. She was put in hot water. Yes, sir. We're going to meet Chantel later on. Okay. Now, because of this behavior on the mother's part, she went to prison for four years. And... Yeah. Due to the abuse, she went to prison for four years. But then she got out of prison. And what happened as far as her custody of her... Once she 15. got out of prison, I was the first one giving back custody to her. And I talked to her about getting my other sisters back. And she went to court and she won. She got the kids back. But after that, maybe three months, it was okay until she got into the wrong crowd and started using drugs. So. Then what happened? So um, I was left alone there to raise my younger sis- sisters and brothers by myself. Worrying about when she's coming back, or how I'm going to get food and stuff like that. How old were you at this point? I was 13. So, as a 13-year-old, you became like the mother mm-hmm. to the other 14. Yeah, and I wound up having a child before I was 14. Okay. What was there also some sexual abuse involved? Yeah, there was sexual abuse towards my sister Chantel from her from my mom's boyfriend. From one of your mother's boyfriends, she yes. sexually abused Chantel. Yes, and my mom didn't believe her. And still today, she don't believe her. It's like we never could talk about it. Okay, so so today, you'd like to develop a bond with your mother. I hear your mother backstage. Let's bring her out. Please welcome Michelle's mother, Kimberly, in the show. To my home. If I'm unfit, why you still let me watch your kids? Recently, Three days in a row. If I'm unfit and I burnt my child intentionally, why do you still bring your kids to my house because, and leave them? Because, Three days. Because your grandkids. I don't give a damn. They cry if I'm unfit, to you. I burn some. If I burn my child and I beat my children like you said, and left with no food and I feed every damn body, I just I made just, groceries for you. It doesn't I just matter. made groceries for you. It doesn't matter. What I just made, made your damn groceries. But I give you money. Y'all don't you come around me. I'm supposed to come I don't to give you. a damn. I'm supposed to be able Y'all don't to come, come around me unless I got money. I'm supposed to. It's not if about money. If I ain't got no money, you don't come around me. If it's about money. Why do you leave you your kids Ch- with me if have I'm unfit? Have, have a seat. If it's about money. Why do you leave Kimberly, your kids have a seat. in my house? If it's about money, I want to be on escort. 
What? It's about do money. You leave your kids alone. No to go do bed bath. To go to exactly. To go do bed bath. But she live in her own house now. But why are you turning but, tricks? But why are you prostitute? I come to you for money. Why are you leave me with your kids? I come to you for money. But I'm not to let her talk. But, Cameron, but, didn't you go to prison but, for four years? For no, for no, child no. abuse. I had a five year sentence for uh, uh, cruelty to a juvenile against two of my kids. Only two. That's because I was whipping Chantel. You beat him. And then you broke their arm. Oh yes, I broke her arm. Holding her arm. And you broke her. In her arm. And you tied her to chair. Ask me, I'm gonna tell you the truth. But this girl leaves her kids at my house. If I done it intentionally, why you leave your kids for three days in a row? Now let's do this, Mama. Why? You, all right, I'm not gonna answer that question until you answer mine. Why did you go to prison for four years? For beating my child, okay. Chantel. Oh no. Why did you beat Chantel? Because Chantel was the type of child that goes in the refrigerator while you sleep and pull out cooked food and put it all over the house. How old is she? So I locked her in the room. Four, five, six. I locked, she was like five years old. Five years old. I locked her in the room so she won't come you out and do it again. But. It was not intentionally being burnt. I thought I ran hot in cold water, and I put her in the water, and it was hot, and it burned her. But far as me doing it on purpose, this girl would not leave her kids with me if I did it on purpose. You went to prison for four years on not, purpose. Oh, yes, I did. When didn't you on purpose? I did my time for it. Yeah. And when, and when you got for it. I, I did my, my kids with. there I because my She said children. it continues today. My, okay. Why? Because my kids love their grandma. I don't give a damn if they love their grandma. Oh. Why do you leave your kids if I beat them? With, you don't beat my kids. You, you don't beat my kids. kids. If I'm unfit. Then again, my kids have nothing to do with it. If I'm unfit, we're talking about your kids my have siblings. nothing to do with it. We're talking about my siblings. Your kids are in danger, That's, right? No, they're not in danger. Okay, what the hell? That's irrelevant. Thank right. you. Michelle, I can't believe well, that. Let's forget about Thank the grandchildren. They're not in danger. Talk, why did we're you behave the way you behaved? Because I was years. young and I was stupid at the time. Drunk and stupid. I was young and dumb at the time. Were you into drugs, too? I was not on no damn drugs, did No drugs. she know it. The drugs came she about after it. four years. The drugs came about she in 2001. It. Give a damn when the it came, came about. about. Was it then? And it's still going on. Oh, it's still and on. it's still going on. Oh, drug test me, please. How many kids you do you have at home now? It's going in three days. It's going in three days. And I still have hers. It goes in three days. That's why they're not gonna find I mean, it. They can't find it. She came, got, no, she called me, Mom, I need groceries. Okay, come on. Why? I'm because I'm at the grocery store making my, my groceries. My sister Chantel come on. just got the phone for five years. I'll make five your groceries. I'll make your groceries. She want a hundred out of here? Okay. You like this here? Kimberly, do you want a well, real party for Michelle? Well, I'm why am I on an escort site? I'm on drug site. You tell me that. Escort site. She on back page. She's trying to tricks while I watch the damn kids. For my kids. She don't give me. I know she'll be on back page. My kids will never buy your house. Let's, never. Right. Now, hold on. She Let's move on. Let's back up. I'm a man that works I never on the on the you got a job. Kimberly, do okay. you want to have a relationship with your siblings, oh, yeah. especially she, 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 she tells me stuff like, oh, you can't act young. Why you dress like that? You're not young. Well, you cannot change me. Why you do? You can't. You're not young. At your age. Honey, hell, what, what, what relationship do you want with your kids? Um, a, a child and a mother. Yeah. Not a mother and a child. Do you acknowledge well, a lot I'm of wrongdoing? Mother, do you acknowledge a, a lot of wrongdoing? You know what I mean? A lot. A lot of wrongdoing. But that's Why my did past. you do that? Why? That, who knows? That's my past. That's but gone. It's still but look going at the effects. On. It's the effects Sean tells her to be here. It's still going no, on. No, no, it's still it's going on. on. Explain how it's going on. Is, if you get nine sixty eight steps, eighty-six dollars should be nothing. She should be nothing. Should be nothing. But she came to me. But they eat every day. They it's eat full. every day. She brought me to the store. So you think she's a lousy mother? Let me show you a picture. No, she's not a, a picture wrong. with a date She's on. not a lousy mother. No. A picture with she a date. She loves her kids. But just check this out. I'm not unfit. And it proves it. No one proves that? Because she leave her kids with me. Yeah, being dangerous. I got about that burning. point. I'm going to deal with your relationship with your children. Because they beg not your grandchildren. They beg your state. How's your relationship now? Thank you. With, with, with her? Yeah, with your kids. Just bad words. How about Chantel? Oh, we get along great. You just her. So but she's here anymore. She on my pants on my head. She said she on my she's so she's like the spokesman so for her siblings. She's so holy. No, she's not. Chantel been in foster care for five kids. years. Five years. She don't watch kids. Chantel just got out of foster care for she five years. From kids. Dallas, Texas, two months ago. Why and was she? For even, what? Why? For what? Because y'all ran from Dallas. No, no, no. Why? Because they had weed in the house because the parents were dirty. That's why. No, 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 no. That's why. Chantel. Do you take responsibility for the things that you've done? No. No. Let me explain to you why. Explain to me why. Okay, let me explain to you why. Beating, broken arms, belts, and cords. And Dallas, Texas. And four years in prison. Okay, yes, I was wrong for all that. But this right here, what she talking about? It's Shelly, still going these on. These are felonies. You committed What's felonies against children. What's going on? Your icebox empty. Now you. Is it? It is. I got a picture of my you phone. You bought this store. I got a picture of my phone. Did you buy this store? Michelle, are you? Did you buy this store? Go get. 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 Go
Boom. But you just got your stamp, Pick though. Because it's the end of the month. Michelle, it, are you worried stupid. about the seven kids? Yeah, okay, well, Michelle, honey, look at me. I'm not going to disrespect you. Because you're stupid, girl. Right, look no. at this. Hold on, mama. I'll, I'll, I'll be stupid, Tell too, on. if I keep on caring. Tell the truth. I'll be dumb about you. Are you worried about the seven okay. kids she yes, still has? Yes, I am. But yeah, tell look, her what I don't have to worry about. about that. All right, all that I have bad. My own life. My kids are straight. Okay. I choose to care. I choose to care. All that bad I Because they go through the same thing I'm going through, and it's still going on. Take responsibility. All right. You said like you're I not taking school? responsibility. You're like, I miss school? He misses school Why you now. Miss school? You got a man now. Let me... You been in my house Jesus Christ. You asked the 17 I'm school. talking about Dick. Dick. my fault. I'm talking about Dick. Zeke going through. That's my fault. My brother at home going through the same thing we went through. Let me tell you something. I get to the house, no I'm going to take all that. What mom at? No, well, I don't, I don't know. know. She ain't come home next You said you night. got no problem with Chantel. She Guess what? She's coming up next. Stay right there. Chantel is coming. Kimberly faces the daughter she abused. I want to see a change. I know you love me. And I want to see a, a, better, a better you. I'm not going to do it for y'all, Chantel. Well, who are you going to do it for? And emotions explode. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. First of all, if I need count, I'm going to be here today. I'm going to take away to New York. You're not here. Find out what makes mom walk. Let's continue now with troubles between a mother and her daughters and her sons. Do you think your kids only use you for money? Yes. Explain how. No, Explain why? how. Because she don't come to my house. Well, why am I back uh, yes, I got One money. at a time. One at a time. How do they use she you for money? She want me to buy $100 hair. I buy it. Uh, kids stuff. I buy my grandkids stuff all the time. She, if, I, if I don't have money, she do not come around me. Excellent. That's a lie. Lie, text, text. Take it. It's a lie. I buy this whole hair. And, and I'm not that what you calling me. Kimberly, what do you want from Michelle today? She I got a hold of this. Don't respect me. She she don't don't do you respect her? And don't hold my past against me. What about you? My how, past how could is she gone. not hold your past against you when you beat her and her and her siblings? I never beat her. You didn't never touched her. Never. How about an emotionally abuse her? Never touched her. Never touched her. She yeah. must abuse her damn self. So never emotionally abused me. Self. Never emotionally abused me. Never treated you like this. Never emotionally abused me. I never got half of half a half a two thousand. She done it. To go get some drugs. Chantel, she one. done it. Chantel, you got no problems with Chantel, right? No, what's what's Please happened? welcome Michelle's sister what's and Kimberly's other but daughter, Chantel. Chantel, she won't turn up. She won't turn up. She won't turn up. She won't turn up. Did your mother? Hold on, honey. Did your mother? For changing, when you say we don't get along, we don't. I mean, tell the truth, baby. Please. Yeah, I'm telling the truth. No, tell the truth on me and Michelle. Yeah, I'm telling the truth. Do I buy food for Michelle? What happened to you? What happened to you as a child? You was with her. What happened to you as a child? I got beaten okay. and right. my own broken and that. stolen hot water. Oh, I know that. By who? By my mom. By me. And I got tied to a door. Okay, but do you hold that against I, me? No, I don't hold that against I you. I know you don't. And you. No, no, mama. Wait a minute. Mama. 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 Listen to so Chantel. Mama. Mama. You were tied to a door in the police found you. I can't react, but I'm not going to react. Because, no. because it's childish. Mama. Mama. So therefore, I'm not going to school to that level. Mama. She don't know what happened. Mama. She don't even mama. Mama. Yeah, I know mama. what happened. What? I've been in foster care for five years. Okay, why you was in foster care the last night? Let her talk, Mama. Can I talk? Can I talk? Can I talk? Chantel, go ahead. Let her talk. I was in foster care for five years, and... The last I, time. I recently got out two months Why ago. Why you was in there? Mama, let me talk, please. Let her talk. How old are you now, honey? I'm I'm 19. 19. And when I got out, you know, I wanted to show you the truth. Don't skip the part. I wanted Why you was in there? No, let me talk. Let her let talk. talk. I wanted to show you the changed person that was in me and would have thought that you was going to change and you, and you still say yeah. and I And I want the best for you. Without the specifics. Not, talk generally. What kind of... She said you had... What you happened? two had no dispute. When you were growing up, how did your mother treat you? Bad. Real bad. Bad. The worst. Why did you treat her... Why would you treat her the worst? Why? Because, you know... I, I, it was bad. Because at five years old, she got that. beans out of the refrigerator? I can't know. It was more than that. It was every day. Every day? <laughs> every night. Five when, years old. Okay, it was done. Why'd you beat her, tie her, her up, put her in hot water, it. break no. her arm? I regret it. It's over with. In my past, my No, it's not over. No, it's no, with her. It's not over. It's not over. It's not over with. Are they holding on to it? I'm not holding on, Hold to, on to it. Hold on to it. Don't come around me. Let's do this, Mom. Have you ever looked in their eyes and apologized to them? Hell yeah. Without yelling. Uh -huh. Chantel, she ever apologized to you? Uh -uh. I've never told you I was tough for beating you? Uh -uh. When you was in childcare over the phone? Uh -uh. 
I know. I don't remember that. I don't remember that. But mom, night till first. Can I, Mama Chantel? Well, I'm sorry. Let me, you. let me hear. And, but you know, no, what I want. No, she's true. not worthy. I don't tell her nothing. I don't tell her nothing. I don't tell her nothing. Let her talk, talk. Chantel. We, we talk Chantel, about, you got the floor. We they spent about, years in foster care because you were in prison and weren't much of a well, mother. Well, last few years was on herself because they did drugs. Oh, but you were in, in prison and they, they were bounced around foster care. 15 okay. kids. That was you done. seem like this. Forget about that. It's forget over. about it. Mom. Forget about the water. Mom. Forget about the cords. Forget about the broken Mom. arm. Forget about that. They no, can't no, forget no, about no, that. Don't forget about that. Let's not forget about that. Never forget. Mom. Listen to Chantel. Leave, that no, is your daughter. No, you leave you alone. She, no, you. What's going to happen you. is somebody is going to see you. the truth and go through the state that I went through. And they're going to get took in. They're going to get took in. But she's okay. Gonna I'm mom. a parent. She and okay. I'm, I'm, I'm very concerned about my children. Mom, we care. I can't be concerned about the children. Chantel, I'm going to hear from Chantel. You may care. But she no, don't. we both care. No, you care. don't care. Because you're in a house. You don't care. It don't matter. I'm going to hear what I'm going to hear. Chantel the floor. She's been saying it. I've been. Chantel, you got the floor. Explain we, to her. We are not against you. Michelle's not putting oh, nothing no. in my head. Nothing when at I, all, because I, I, I don't know if this me to even worry about Ch it. Chantel, go ahead. You're when I was in foster care, I always used to call Michelle and, you know, to see how things going. I mean, I already know how you are. And me and Michelle, we just, we... You know, you know how you are, Mom. What's great we, what's great we, we want to change. Do you love her? Do you want to change? Love my do you love your mom? Yes, I love her. Tell she, her how much. I love you. And, and, I love and you need to know that. And I want to see a change. I know you love me. And I want to see a, a better, a better you. I'm not gonna do it for y'all, Chantel. Well, who are you gonna do it God. for? I'm not gonna do yeah. it for, for God. I'm not doing nothing for y'all. You know what is it? God thinks about what you did. The path is gone. I did it. Yes, but we let go the path. You got 15 children. She evil. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. First of all, if I didn't care, I don't gotta be here today. I would have came way to New York for nothing. My children are straight. My house is straight. My ice box is straight. Huh? You're gonna fool. They eat every day though. You're gonna fool. But they eat every day. They eat every day. You act like you jealous or something. You act like you jealous or something. Y'all knew that was true. What are we doing? My children eat. I don't leave my children for hours. I don't beat my children. Mom. No way. No, I'm going to let go. Me. You need Mom. some help. You need Me. some help. And this is a chance to get help. This is a chance to get help. You need some help. This is a chance to get help. Chantel, do you want a relationship with your mom? Yes, I do. Do you want a relationship with her? Do you understand how lucky you are after what you did to that child? She loves you and want a relationship. Think about that. You broke her arm. You beat her. You put her in hot water. And she loves you. And she wants a relationship. You should thank God for that. That's what you should do. Thank God. Where do we go from here? If today is the first day of the rest of your lives together, Chantel, how do we go forward? We well, go forward by my mom knowing why that. Why my mom? Everybody. No. Why my mom all the time? Why mom. just my mom? Mom. Y'all need help too? Mom. We all need help. We all Everybody. need help. We need major help. Mom. <laughs> you are jealous. You need mom. major help. You're jealous. That's I'm all. Your mother. I can't Let me be. tell you something. I don't want to tell you. Mom. How am I jealous? When? When? She when? never went to prison for mom, child abuse. You. you my mom. I'm supposed to. When? Yeah. My daddy well, you want to show. Show. Hold on. Show. What do you want? Hold on. Kimberly, listen up. Kimberly, Kimberly, listen up. If I didn't care, if I didn't care, I would have contacted these people. If I didn't care. For your own reasons, you did. Own reasons for what? We. Money, money don't money. Yes, to help you. We want to. We you need to change. Okay, y'all need to change. I I am changed. Y'all need to change. Mom, you're the change. You're the adult. You need to change. Well, treat me like an adult. Well, then you treat them like one of your children. Dress. I'm coming to get your card and take it. Mom, you ain't got your own damn I'm coming to get your card. You ain't got to go to your own damn house. How do we help? How do we help? Mom, you know why? Because I forgot to burn my checks the other day. I got food. That's why. You got food or you got wig? That's your irresponsibility. You got wig. You got wig. You be irresponsible. We'll be back with more. Stay right there. I'm shocked, Chantel. Chantel never felt or told me anything at all. Okay, but she's telling me I'm still the same when I'm not. Come here, Mama. 
Let's let's you you and me talk. We're going to make an, an extra extra effort. Have a seat right next to, to Mr. Miller. Get your point of view and not have the first thing. But here, here's the problem. It's years and years of well, foster really homes like, and abuse. If he would look at Chantel, I'm sorry I broke your arm. I'm sorry I put you in hot water. I'm sorry I tied you down. I'm sorry you spent years in foster care. It was my fault, and I'm responsible, and I'm sorry. And you say, Michelle, I'm sorry that I've not been there for you, and I apologize, and I'm done arguing with you. I will never again raise my voice to you. That's what when we go back. That's what we're going to do. And that's and then your voice is down. And I bet the kids love you. And I bet they hug you. And you have the relationship you want. She has made me feel like I am so useless of a parent. She's always going to be better is that for my true? daughter. No. An explosive mother-daughter battle over a child. A mother took. The daughter. I didn't take anything. I did not take okay, anything. Didn't take and the man that's helping to raise her. I can't be there if you have six months. I understand six months, but I can't You can't expect me to be a father if you don't let me be one. Uh-uh, no. 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 U
but he's not. Yeah. No, but he acts like he, he does more for them than their fathers have ever done. Please welcome Melody's boyfriend, Lloyd, to the show. Lloyd, come on out. Hi, Lloyd. Hello. What do you go through every day? What is going on in this relationship? Lack Future mother-in-law. Huh? Lack of respect. How can I respect who you res when I... Uh, go ahead. Who respects who? asked you not to bathe her, not to dress okay, her. Okay, now that doesn't make sense. He's so protective of this little girl. Mama. And wants everything to do up. with her. It's but ridiculous. But when she says, hey, mom, Kayla needs a bath. Does she get a bath? My daughter freaks no. out if you get I, her hair wet. She was too tired. She, she screams to to if you get her hair wet. So what is it like? Be, uh, the problem is, on. if I had a little child and a man in the home who seemingly is appropriate, despite your background in prison, I mean, that's a different yeah. issue, but you behave appropriately with the child, why do you care? It's their family. Why, it's not their family. It's not his family. It's he not, just it he barely got into the picture. It is his family because he loves I have been there too. since she's six months old. Yes, he I've done everything back back so he can be in the family, too. You need to give him. She's not your daughter, it's her daughter. But she should have taken care of her from the very beginning. She didn't take care of her. We'll be back with more. Stay right there. We'll be back. This mom is told to back off once and for all. This is my life, sir. You're not my life. No, but you're in my house with my grandkids. A secret is revealed. You did? And what the hell's going on around this place? And the moment you can't miss is coming up. Is your loved one dating a loser? Do you want to break them up and then fix them up with their secret crush? Come do it on our show. Contact me at BillCunninghamShow.com. Call me at 1-855-US-BILL or text guest at 95902. Message and data rates may apply. Love watching from your couch? Wait until you see us live. If you're going to be in the New York City area and want free tickets to see a taping of the show, go to our official website, BillCunninghamShow.com, or call toll free eight. I feel where she's coming from. I don't want to say, hey, you know what? Here I am in your life. Step away. You know what I mean? You're the grandma. You did do a lot for her. You did raise her. I know you have that connection. It feels like a second chance to raise a daughter. But don't deny her a father. Lots of mother, lots of mother-daughter conflicts today. We talked about nursing. You're saying, you paint a picture of this woman as a bad mother, not present, not cleaning the child, not caring for the child, correct? Correct. She says so that's completely that false, not even close. Lloyd, what is true? This is what's true. How can you ask him what's true? He's only been there six months. She gave, the last six months. Months. She gave birth to a daughter. Oh she raised a daughter for the six months, breastfed her, whatever. She fell into depression. A mother, really a mother took the daughter. I didn't take anything. I did not take okay, anything. Didn't take we it. Lived I took responsibility because the mother house. had depression. It's not that you okay, so I have now, depression, but that because somebody you from falls doing anything. in life. I'm not saying you took you her. You take their kid? You help. Nobody took her you don't kid. Get, you don't That's give her the opportunity the to better herself? That's not the no. problem. Opportunity. I gave her opportunity. She's Mom. had opportunity. No, you don't. Mom. Yes, I did. Didn't you offer to she give your mother to sign over the child? Time. No, hold on, Lloyd. Have... Did you say to your mother, take the child? I had talked to her about it. Cause... Twice. Twice, because she has made me feel like I am so useless of a parent I, for so I, long, no, that is not, and that, that is it's not. never going to change. She's always going to be better is that for true? my daughter. No, uh, it is not. I usually bite my tongue and just take care of what needs to be taken care of. Let me bite is, your tongue. You're wrong. Right you you we got judging somebody else. So, uh, what kind of mother that was she to you? Was what kind of mother me. was she to you? She what was kind of that baby was for me until me. I hit my teens. When you're the grandma, grandma. She hit her teens. What, what happened? Like, what happened when you hit the teens? What happened? She, she met her boyfriend. And, and then what? Then ten years with just him, and I lived with my friend off and on, and went up to Alaska with my. Do brother. you think she wants to be a good mother to Michaela because she wasn't a good mother to you? I feel that she she's even said it that she feels like she's making up for a second time. chance. Yes, but so, it's not a second chance. I don't want my daughter raised you know, how I was raised. Why don't you move out, move out of her home, job. and then you want to? This is what problems. it is. That little girl. It's is a so it's so torn but between, she's not between your these two life. people. She's because my daughter. when she wants to have her daughter or have something to do with her discipline, changing, bathing, feeding, her. 
You can't, can't discipline. Can't. See, Linda, what would you do if she moved out? Legally, you what? can't stop what her. What would I do if you, well, if she moved out, then Lori would take her. She don't allow her to be a mom. Then what if you saw him once a month? Terrible. It'd be how would it be terrible? Terrible. He loves her more than any other person. This little girl. Does Michaela call you daddy? Yes. Yes, she does. More often than not. Right, but she should oh. all the time. She why, should. Why, Linda, why do you dislike Lloyd so much? What's he done wrong? So, 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 so person like coming into a life can't hold on, be hold a father on. Linda, because they're not the biological father? You're not father. the father. You, you know, it takes a it while to become matter. a mother. You have no parenting skills. How you have a girl. A kid. That little because girl don't care if I'm... Games. You know what? The, the way this world is right the baby? now, the way this world is right now, <laughs> the way these people are, she I don't want to Linda, why don't you? Lloyd looks to me like a fairly, <laughs> like a fairly <laughs> nice dude. Why don't you like Lloyd? I do. There's nothing I don't like him. I, I don't, don't think you like him. He steps and his boundaries take take with that little girl. What? I understand her. I understand not. Melanie, you need to be independent of your mother and raise that child in a family. And she would get up and do something. Will you do that? She would get up and do anything. Every day. You're working for her. Lloyd, do you work? She no, doesn't get out of care either. for the uh, little girl. I care for her. Her. She's with me all the time, except for it's, when you come in. You're dragging her with you. But I have taken her to a doctor's appointment. I got up in the you middle of the night. You took her to a doctor's appointment one time These a couple two months ago. argue so much over this little girl. I take her to the doctor. Look, a lot of felons have a lot of work. You can find work if you want. I'm not saying I can't find work. But it's harder for it's me harder. to find work. Yeah, but, but it's not impossible. It's not that I don't go Let's do this. At the end of the day, you got a decision to make, Melody. At the end of the show, I'd like you to be able to say, I'm leaving. Linda, you're kicked to the curb, and I'm going to go. Or stay in that situation and have to face this every day. We'll be back with more. Stay right there. Love watching from your couch? Why don't you see us live? If you're going to be in the New York City area and want free tickets to see a taping of the show, go to our official website, BillCunninghamShow.com, or call toll-free 888-710-8425 for your chance to talk back with Bill. It's time to go to your phone and get ready for today's viewer decision. Linda hates that her daughter, Melody, lets her boyfriend, Lloyd, act as a father figure to her kids only after six months together. Do you think Linda is right to be concerned? Call 855-TELL-BILL with your decision. You're also going to receive some valuable offers. What will you decide? Call 855-TELL-BILL now. You know, as hard as it is to hear your loved one say, you're a bad mom. It does not compare to the hurt that bad mothers cause. We've heard from all of my guests. Now my audience must have their say. It's time for Talk Back with Bill. What I have to say to you is I'm a mother. And I love my children. They're my world. I would do anything for them. So you as a mother, first thing you have to do is take responsibility because mothers have to lead by example. When I do something, my daughters want to do it. How can you expect them to change if you're not willing to change? You should be thankful that they love you enough to want to have a relationship with you. I'm the mother I am today because of my mother. How can you expect them to be anything greater if you yourself cannot set an example? You have to change if you want to change for them, not for you, for them. That's your children. They should be everything, and they should be first. We had a little bit of a breakthrough earlier. I'm going to talk about in a few minutes, but go ahead. I think you should step it up a little bit, be a better mother. Uh, I agree I have things to and work let your, on, let your, let your mother help you. Good mother. I yeah, wanted to help, help you. I just don't want her to take over. He ain't going to do nothing for you. He's How there, is he he's not going to do you. anything he's there for me? He, he does he, everything he, for he, me. You he take care of him. Me. That's why he's there. How do I take care of him? I have nothing to give him. And your mother's more important than he is. Every day, I cook, clean, laundry. What does he do for me? Yeah, because you don't want to do it. You got to step it up. Lady. Boy, you're I living with them. I don't them. want to do it. We you know, do it together. You you my question, my question to her, her. Linda, what's a Lord? father? A sperm donor? No, a father is somebody that's been there. He has, he has, He's been there. I can't six be years. there if you don't want to be there. I understand. Six, six months, months, but I can't You can't expect me to be a father if you don't let me be one. Linda, do you want him to be the father of your grandchild? Do you want him to be the father? Yeah, two people. No, if two people go and have an egg put in them from another person, they're not the father of the, and the mother to that child? If you adopt a child, you're not the mother and father to that child? You don't adopt nobody. Well, fathers are one thing, dads are another. Do you want him? You know, you do what you're, you're good with the kids. But six months, you're, it's I not a six, six months. months. We can't make this is my life, sir. You're not my life. 
Now that you're in my house with my grandkids, with my kids, it's my kids. Linda, you know what? Linda, at this point, this, this is what you're going to do. You're going to make it so bad that we move out and that poor little girl is not going to see you. Because you don't know how to let go you're not, you're not of gonna anything. Do that. It's, it's going to be like this forever. Linda, yeah. it's Melody's choice in men. You may not have picked Lloyd, but she did. She's an she adult. Wanted she him picked me. She wanted him to marry his girlfriend. She wanted me to break up with my girlfriend to and took it with her. You did? She and what the hell is going on around this place? She said I was the best guy she ever met. We'll be back with more. Stand right there. We'll be back. Here, and today's question is pretty heavy. Could you forgive a parent who abused you as a child? Well, 61% of you out there said, I don't think so. At Shade Furry posted, no, scars never heal. Well, weigh in now on Facebook to tell us your thoughts. Is your loved one dating a loser? Do you want to break them up and then fix them up with their secret crush? Come do it on our show. Contact me at BillCunninghamShow.com. Call me at 1-855-US-BILL or text GUEST. <laughs> Is it possible for a child to get past betrayal and abuse and build a better relationship with a bad mom? Please welcome relationship expert Stacy Nelkin to the show. Stacy, how you doing? I'm okay. Now... Before you before you say something, Kimberly and I were backstage yeah. uh, in the green room, and we spoke about mechanisms that have worked on the show for years about alleged bad mothers. And, and I think, Kimberly, you have something you want to say first to Chantel and then to Michelle on the show. So, Kimberly, what do you have to say to your daughter on your left that you really went to prison for abusing for four yeah, years? I just, I just want to say... Um... I'm sorry for everything I ever done from being this baby up until now. I'm sorry. And please don't hold it to kiss me. I love you. Aww. Aww. All right, now, Kimberly, what do you have to say to Michelle? I just want to say I'm sorry for making you watch the kids when you were small because I had to work. Um, and. Whatever I did to you, whatever I did, please forgive me. And don't break it up no more, please. Here you go, Mama. <laughs> right. So, Stacy, in the green room, it wasn't me, it was Kimberly. She recognized the course, the road they're on, is self-destructive. The cars are going too fast as a turn-up ad. They're going to go straight out over the hill. And she decided to change and go the other direction and to stop yelling and screaming, accept responsibility and the unconditional love from the children. Right. And, and I think this was a breakthrough with Kimberly, which Absolutely. I, I feel proud of her for what she done. What do you have to say about the new relationship? Uh, I think this is absolutely amazing. And I think you girls are saints that you were abused and that you still have love for this woman and she is your only mother look you can you may never forgive <laughs> i looks like you have already you will certainly never forget but it looks like you've let go and that you two are still here and want a relationship you are a very blessed woman that you did this because there are consequences and you've had to deal with a lot of michelle's anger and rightly so but these girls these beautiful girls are angels that they could forgive you and still want a relationship and with you and she went through hell herself is, as a child uh, I'm you know the sure mother you did, the daughter became too. the mother who becomes the daughter and so Absolutely. Kimberly has not had a better roses in her life that we haven't talked about but she's right. had a, a bad things happen to her and so now she reflected upon her kids and thank god Today will be the first day of the rest of their Absolutely. lives together. Absolutely. This is, this is the most beautiful thing you guys can actually have a relationship.
And it must have been so hard for you to have to be a mother when you were a child, you know, yourself. No question. And to see that your baby sister was being hurt. You girls are miracles. You really are. And and this is this is what it's all about. Let's Transformation. To, uh, I, I couldn't feel better of all the get we've had like four thousand really guests beautiful. on. This is a show it's, when I'm in the retirement home for yeah. old television talk show host. <laughs> I'm gonna remember this show. Uh, let's go to Linda, Melody, and Lloyd. You know, look, I think grandmothers are amazing. I had a teenage mom. If I didn't have my grandmother, I wouldn't be who I am today. So I you're blessed once, that you have yeah, a mom. I never once who wants, told her I wasn't ungrateful right, for her. Right. Okay. Help. So but when you were not able to be there, she stepped up to the plate. And I've already But now that. it looks like your daughter's trying to demonstrate that she's a grown up, that she can take care of herself. I think you guys have exactly. to move out. You have to get jobs. Yeah. And I also agree, yeah, though, it's that. not appropriate. He should not be bathing. You have three kids, though, by three different men, yes? yes. Yes. So that's why I think your mom is not necessarily so sure that Lloyd, I'm sure you're a great guy, but not so sure that Lloyd's going to stay in the picture. She needs and I to understand see. That, but she doesn't sure need to act like every single day he's well, leaving. And the two boys, it's fine. Let's do this. In yeah. the beginning, <laughs> Linda, you wanted Lloyd to date your daughter. Whatever that was, that was, go back to those times. Give this couple a chance. Right. When we continue, right. it's the bottom line. For more info, go to the website, BillCunningInShow.com. Want to take a peek behind the cameras? Then follow me on Twitter. Like me on Facebook. Circle me on Google+. Or follow me on Instagram because you don't want to miss a minute of the backstage drama. It's unedited, unfiltered, and unbelievable. It's time to go to your phone and get ready for today's viewer decision. Linda hates that her daughter, Melody, lets her boyfriend, Lloyd, act as a father figure to her kids only after six months together. Do you think Linda is right to be concerned? Call 855-TELL-BILL with your decision. You're also going to receive some valuable offers. What will you decide? Call 855-TELL-BILL. I can say this. Today, we had a breakthrough. And if you've been betrayed and abused by a mother or by any person, guess what? Here's the bottom line. Scars from abuse take a long time to heal. In this case, it's taken 40 years for this dear mother to get over some of the pain that she went through as a child that she inflicted upon her own children to go to prison for four years for abuse, then to come out and have your kids go back into foster care, back and forth. Man, that's, that's wrong. That's an evil. But in the green room, I think we had a breakthrough and a recognition that something special happened today. And I pray that when we check back, that you've not gone back to the old ways, mm -hmm. but you're going to stay where you are today because the feelings you have today, if this continues, you're going to be a great mom and these kids are going to love you with all their heart. Yeah. I want to thank you all for coming in and we'll see you the next time.